Let's play going down to Cairo. Now, I've got dots right there, but I'm going to change my dots, so don't go totally by these. I Sometimes I'm, I'm torn. Whether, am I going to uh, give you a, a true re old-timer's rendition, or am I going to give you my rendition? And I think I'm gonna, in this case, I'm going to give you my rendition, which is a little bit different noting. Uh, may, maybe a few fewer notes, actually, but uh, a little more fun to play, I think. So, so you can use this kind of as a guide. The first part's pretty reliable, the A part, but the B part, I'll ultimately change a little few things. I'll post that up tomorrow or later this evening. Uh, if you're a patron, I'll post it up there. If you want a copy of the music and you're not, you can just email me, bigfiddleshow at gmail.com, and I'll send you a little PDF of the tune for tonight, okay? So, and this will be archived on my Patreon site as well after we're done here today. So let's play a little bit. It's a simple little tune, but it's fun to play. It's a great little jam tune to play with your friends. So here we go with uh, Cairo. I'm going down to Cairo. Okay, so, uh, oh, Kim, I'm glad you're saying you've always wanted to learn this. It's, it's not a hard tune at all, and, and it's fun to play. You, you know, sometimes I think the Camp Possum tunes, I, put, I stretch you, you know, with those, and I wanted to do a little a couple times a month where I just play a tune that, man, you could pick up just like that. So that's what this one is for. And I've got some more in mind. If you have some other little tunes you want to learn, just send me a message by email or uh, with the Patreon site, you can send me a message. But... Uh, so yeah, let's play a little bit of this. I'm going to play it through one more time, slow, and then I'll sh break it down for you, okay? a little bit of shot of the view, shot of the bow and also the fingers. So the first thing is we're going to play, let's play this unison here. It's uh, uh, around octaves rather. It's a D on the A string and the open D. That's the first little bit. One more time. And then stay on this D. Or even here. Okay, here we go. So you repeat that, so let's do that one more time. So what we're doing there is start on this open A. Some of the last 
last little bit is or that chord or or this unis this uh, octave thing drone drone let's play it through a couple times here we go one two ready play Sometimes there I'll play the open A with that D. Okay, here we go. One more time from the beginning. Ready, go. This is an old Noe, Noe Beavers. His, his name's uh, Noah, but the old timers he called him. No, Noe Beavers. He was one of the old boinkers that they recorded. The guy was actually a really, really good fiddle player. He's uh, in the book a lot, and he's on those. There's a three CD set Kim mentioned there. It's a really great set of recordings, all field recordings of the old fiddlers from Illinois. So, okay, one more time here. Facebook. Can you see it? <laughs> is it showing up on Facebook? I hope it is. I can't tell what's... I just throw it out there, you know, and it's ne whatever happens, happens. So right, we're going to do the second part now. So I hope you got most of that. And then when we're done, I'm going to back up and play it a bunch of times through on the fiddle. You just play along with me real slow, kind of loop it around and around. And then we'll play it on the mandolin. So if you missed a note or two, you can get it off the mandolin as well. So here we go with the second part. Let me play through it once. Strip it down to its bare essentials when I show it to you here. And then as I play through it, I'll play some variations and add a few notes in, make it more interesting. But let's just stay with the, the bare essentials right now if we can, all right? So here we go with uh, the second part of going down to Cairo. So what I'm ending up there, on that's the, in the second bar. Now, again, if you've got the dots, I'm not playing exactly from the dots. I'm kind of playing my own rendition. I'm going to, I'm going to put, I think I'll put out a second version of the dots. That'll be the way I'm showing it to you tonight, but then you still have the Noe Beavers version to look back at too, if you want to add a few notes. So, so let, let, we're just playing, uh, I've, got, I've got a pickup note, I've got D to F sharp, and then G twice, A twice, B twice, and then a chord. Same 
exact thing as we did in the first part, remember? So we're going to steal that measure we already know from the first part. Or you can just go... Let's do that for right now. Let me play you through how we're teaching it all the way through now. I'm not going to put in any of the extra notes. We're just going to, we're just playing the bare minimum here. Phrase by phrase, one more time. So open D, open D to the F sharp, that's the pickup notes. And then G. A, B, little C, and now we can put a little chord in there. You can put this E below. Okay, I think we're ready to back up a little bit, and I'm just going to play through it a few times on the fifth. Some, some uh, menu thingy was in the way. Let's see. Can you throw in an e, open E with the C? Is that the question you were asking me about, Pat? Yeah. Yes, you sure could. Uh, she's also, you could do that. I kind of like this better, but you certainly could do that. It's the same note, right? Yep, you can certainly do that. Uh, so sorry I missed your question there, Kim. Uh, let's see. So, but but I, I'm kind of partial to the lower the E on the D string with that C. So it's E on the D string with the C on the A string, and we're in C, and we're in G. So that's a C natural, right? All right. Sorry about that. Do 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 do. Here we go. With uh, I'm going to Cairo, going down to Cairo. By the way, a little geography lesson if you don't know where Cairo is. That's in an area where the delta, the big joining of the confluence of two massive rivers, the two, two of the biggest rivers in uh, North America. The two biggest are the Missouri and the Mississippi, but down where the Ohio joins in, right at the bottom of, of Illinois, that's right, the, the Ohio River forms that bottom border of Illinois, and it dumps into the Mississippi River. And so there's a town called, in this delta region, uh, uh, that's called Cairo, Illinois. And some famous blues musicians are from Cairo, Illinois, by the way. But uh, So uh, that's uh, also an area they call Little Egypt, not surprisingly, with a town named Cairo. There's all this other references to Egypt in that few counties down there in southern Illinois. But So uh, we're playing, it's Cairo, not Cairo, by the way. <laughs> So let's go. Let's play a little bit. I'm going down to Cairo. Here we go. Sorry about that.
at home. All right, are you going down to Cairo? I sure am. It's a wonderful place. A lot of people are going down to Cairo. Well, I had to pull the chat down. I didn't realize it was going on. It wasn't scrolling automatically. A lot of people are here tonight. Holy cow. Denison from Arkansas. All right, man, good. Oh, I think he's a bot. Oh, he's a bot. We got a bot tonight. A bot. Oh, welcome. Who did you welcome say all was here? bots. Uh, T Thomas Coriel. I don't see him yet. Oh, he's on Facebook. See, you're le you're not watching on Facebook. No, I'm watching yeah. on YouTube. Yeah, you should watch it on YouTube. There's three platforms. Jim's so here. We're, we're, I'm lucky to keep track we're stream, of one. But yeah, there's a bot here tonight. I like to welcome all the bots here bot. tonight. Yeah, he's a bot. <laughs> Fancy it up. Oh, fancy it up. Yes, that's, it's time to play it fancy yeah. it up. Fancy it up. All right, so with, the, with all the extra notes. So here we go. But that was the basic version. That'll get you by. But yeah, you can put more notes in it. Not, it's not a real fancy tune, but let's see what we can do. stuff in there I hit a few clams that was actually that was true improvisation that was not an arrangement so that no. the, da the danger in that is you ah, might hit a few bad notes but that's okay not.